Welcome Exiles! This time I want to show you my Lightning Conduit build which costs only one Divine Orb. Singularity Scepter is the best choice if you don't have enough currency. Spirit Shield with spell damage and plus level of all Lightning spell skill gems. Body Armor with spell suppress, life and resistances. Algar Mortis Gloves is very good. Boots with spell suppress, life, resistance and movement speed. Amulet with spell damage and plus level of all lighting skill gems. Doriani Invitation Belt with lighting damage. Balakos Signed Ring with more lighting damage. Circle of Regret Topaz Ring with more damage. And Circle with life and needed resistances. From the flask, so we need Granite, Quicksilver, Silver, Life with Bleeding Immunity and Quartz Flask which improve our spell suppression to almost 50%. Also, I bought a lot of gems for this build. First of all, our main damage setup, Lightning Conduit, Lightning Penetration, Aided, Lightning Damage, Elemental Focus, Hypothermia and Cruelty Support. From Auras, I took Crest, Herald of Thunder, Determination, also Molten Shell on left click button and and Orb of Storms is very important too. In the skill tree I took all lightning damage nodes, mana reservation, casting speed, Eldritch battery is very important in our build too, for making our skills eat energy shield instead of mana. In the ascendancy all simple, Shaper of Storms, uh, Shaper of Winter, Mastermind and Heart of Destruction. Here is all skills what we will use in the battle. Our main damage setup, Lightning Conduit, Hypothermia, Elemental Focus, Cruelty Support, Added Lightning Damage and Lightning Penetration. Warp of Storms, which add shock to our enemies with Chain, Unbound Ailments and Elemental Proliferation. Stormbrand with Spell Echo, Cooling Strike and Unbound Ailments. Rust with Divine Blessing and Inspiration, so we can use it all the time for our energy shield. From Auras, Herald of Thunder, Determination, Defiance Banner and Purity of Elements, Molten Shell on the left click button and Flame Dash for movement. In the Pantheon I wanted to increase physical damage reduction, so I took Lunaris and Groot Cool. So how this build works? First of all you need to shock your enemies with Orb of Storms or Stormbrand with a Chain Gem, then you just use Enlightened Conduit on them, because this skill works only on shocked enemies. On bosses or fat mobs we need to use Res Aura, but we can use it always because of Eldritch Battery. In the white maps everything was good, mobs can't kill us and they are dying just from Orb of Storms. In the yellow maps everything is the same, but bosses have more HP and dine a little bit longer. In the red maps we are start feeling problems, mobs can kill us and I died a few times during showcase recording and we can see all problems here, that we don't have good defense and we can die pretty simple, so I wanted to play more safely and stand on the distance from dangerous mobs.
The main challenge for me was Maze of the Minotaur, but surprisingly that was pretty simple map and I died only 2 times out of 8 maps, so this build clearing Guardian maps very good. But what about Minotaur? That was a pretty hard fight, because it feels that we need more damage, because he has a lot of HP, also he almost one shot in us, but if you invest more currency he will die for 2 seconds. In the conclusion I can say that it's the best boss killer in 3.19 and I think GGG will fix it in the next patch, uh, because when you buy good gear all bosses in the game like Cirrus or Maven die for the 5 seconds and in my opinion it's a big imbalance. This build has a medium clearing speed, not so fast because you need to shock your enemies. This build has a pretty bad defense, so if you have not the best gear, you will die a lot. After all, I can say that even the end game gear setup costs uh, not so much. This build is very good league starter, because starting items has a very low price, but as I said before, I think this skill will be nerfed in the next league, we will see guys. That's all what I wanted to tell you about Lighting Conduit Elementalist, thanks for watching and subscribe to my channel, goodbye exiles.